Contracts. Contracts. A contract is like a promise between people. I hope we can go to a happy agreement between the two of us. Each person should write down what they promise to do. Let me see what I can promise here. And I'll do the same for you as well. Including how much they get paid. Yep, there's a lot of money for you, alright. And how they can use your work. Yes, that's a deal. Contracts should be easy to understand. What are you talking about? If you don't understand, ask for help. Can you please tell me what he's trying to tell me? David is a dancer. Emma is organizing an event. David certainly is gonna love this. She books David to perform at the event. Oh yes, that sounds like fun! David and Emma sign a contract. Sign here, please. Weeks later, Emma calls to say the event has been cancelled. Oh darn, I've been looking forward to that for weeks. Emma pays the cancellation fee that she promised in the contract. Oh well, I hope this money can make up for it. Yes, thank you so much. When needed, contracts should be given in big text, braille or Auslan. Here, let me help you translate that to braille for you. If you need help with a contract, ask for help or contact Arts Law. We will need all the help that we can get. Of course, my dear. Bob hires Jane to make a video, but a contract is confusing. This is dumb. I don't understand a single thing about it. She asks Bob to explain it to her. Bob realizes he had made some mistakes. Jane asks Arts Law to help with the contract before she signs it. Oh yes, that makes total sense. And if you ask me, when it comes to Arts Law, you need all the help that you can get. If you need help, you contact Arts Law. Oh yes, Arts Law here. How can we be of your assistance? Beep, 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 beep. And off we go, traveling in our ship across the galaxy, helping people with Arts Law everywhere. Beep, 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 beep. Full speed ahead. <laughs>